Another popular event this time of year is the Devon Horse Show and Country Fair. Yes, the longest running multi-breed horse show in the country, and it happens right in Chester County. Meteorologist Chelsea Ingram joins us now at the fairgrounds where everyone is enjoying the beautiful <laughs> weather, even Chelsea herself. Beautiful chapeau. <laughs> hey, Yuki. Hey, Jess. You know what, Jess? Ever since you were here last year for Summerfest, I have been wanting to come here so bad. And I'm so glad that today I got to bring the mobile weather watcher along with me. It is an absolutely stunning spring evening. It feels like summer, though, and the weather watcher has been checking in all afternoon and evening with temperatures in the 80s. We're live here at the Devon Horse Show. Take a look at everything that's going on behind me. I mean, this is absolutely an equestrian lover's dream. The Devon Horse Show and Country Fair. It's a 10 day event. It attracts horse lovers from across the world. And Wayne Grafton, chairman and CEO of the Devon Horse Show and Country Fair joins me now. So Wayne, tell me what's new this year at the Devon Horse Show, what people can expect to be different from last year. Well, first of all, let me say welcome back. Thank it's you. always great to have CBS Three with here. us. And uh, we have a wonderful 11 day program lined up. Aside from horses, we have a midway for the young kids. We have shopping for the ladies, Ooh. whole host of uh, places to like dine. This, right? You certainly can, and yours <laughs> looks lovely. Uh, thank you. We're going to have a, a marvelous show in the sense that the competition is going way up this year. We're going to have seven Olympians with us. Wow. Three of the uh, Olympians will be competing in the open jumper events during the week. Uh, those three were the three silver medalists at the Rio Olympics wow, from two years ago. That's impressive. Sunday night, yeah, we will be the only show in North America that is hosting arena eventing. Last year it was a sellout crowd, so if you're not doing anything Sunday night, come out and see us. All right. And uh, we have all so many uh, other activities you can engage in that uh, if you have the interest. We have Excellent. all sorts of things for you to do. Wayne, thank you so much. And as far as the weather is concerned, I mean, Friday is looking fantastic. Tomorrow's going to be another glorious day. We're looking at temperatures that are going to be in the 80s, warm with sunshine, humidity and check on Friday. But as we head into Saturday, that's when humidity is on the uptick. Things start to turn a little bit more unsettled. And late Saturday and especially into Sunday, we are going to bring some showers and thunderstorms back into the forecast.